Okay, hi everybody. We're gonna do some yoga. So we have a half hour. We'll do some Shivananda sun salutations first, which is a kind of a gentle basic warm up, And then we'll move into a version of uh, a vinyasa flow, which I put together. Mostly just the most difficult poses, but we're gonna do it in a really easy basic way. So let's stand up top of the mat and we'll begin. I'll put some music on, feet are apart, lift the arches a little, hands in prayer, exhale, and bring the arms up by the ears, press the hips forward. Don't drop your head back like that. Keep your chin up, just press the hips forward. You can gaze up. Then press the hips back, hands down in line with the toes, drop the head, hold the stomach in, look up 18 inches, bring the right leg back, drop the right knee, inhale, look up. Look at that 18 inch point again, lift the hips, keep the hips high, come to a plank, bring the knees forward and down, chest forward and down, thighs off the floor, come into the cobra. Inhale, press the hip, the chest forward. Downward dog, exhale. Look up to the 18 inch point, right foot forward, drop the left knee. Inhale, arms up, I mean head up. Left foot forward, forward down. Inhale, arms out by the ears and up. Exhale, hands down the line with the toes. Drop the head. Look up at that 18 inch point. That keeps your chin lifted and your neck in line with the spine. Stepping back the left foot, drop the left knee. Inhale, look up. Look at the 18 inch point. Come to a plank. Lower the knees, chest, chin. Come into cobra. Look at the third eye. Downward dog, gaze at the navel. Look up at the 18 inch point. Bring the left foot forward, drop the right knee, inhale, third eye. Exhale, foot at the top of the mat, drop the head. Inhale, arms out by the ears and up and back. Exhale, hands down, right leg back, drop the knee, inhale. Hold the breath, plank, knees, chest, chin, cobra, inhale. Downward dog, exhale. Right foot forward, drop the left knee, inhale. Left foot forward, exhale. Inhale, arms out, up and back. Exhale, hands down. Left leg, inhale. Hold the breath, plank. Knees, chest, chin. Cobra, inhale. Downward dog, exhale. Left foot forward, inhale. Right foot forward, exhale. Keep your thoughts positive. It's not easy, but you keep learning to do it. Keep going, keep going. Yoga's supposed to be confusing and challenging so you can build your coping skills. Inhale, exhale. Left leg back, inhale, hold the breath, plank, knees, exhale, chest, chin, cobra, inhale, downward dog, exhale, left foot forward, right foot forward, inhale, one more round, exhale, right leg back, inhale, hold the breath, plank, knees, chest, chin, exhale, cobra, inhale, Downward dog, exhale. Right foot forward, inhale. Left foot forward, exhale. Inhale. Exhale, hands down. Left leg back. Inhale. Plank. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Left foot forward. Inhale. Right foot forward. Exhale. Arms out and down by your side. Take a moment, you can lie down on your back just for a second, really fast. Ah. 
Ah, you lay down, try to lay down just for a second. You just want to feel the blood rushing through the body. Everything opening, no blockages, brains flowing, organs are pumping, your aura is exploding. Smile inside. Send a wave of gratitude and good vibes to the body. Okay, knees into the chest. Roll around a little. However you like to get to the top of your mat, you roll to the side, come up. And now we're gonna start the vinyasa series. This is a little harder, okay? So we're gonna stand at the top of the mat. Feet touch this time. Bend the knees deeply. Make sure you can see your feet so your knees aren't over this way. Sit back. Pull the ribs off the thighs. Gaze at the thumbs. Inhale. Come to forward bend. Exhale, head to the knee. Inhale, look up 18 inches. Step back to a plank pose. Keep your hips high. Bend the elbows. Come into cobra, up dog. And down dog. Step the left heel down to the side a little. Bring the right foot forward. Square your hip before you stand up. Lift the arches, suck your stomach in. Inhale, looking at the right thumb. Warrior one. Looking at the right thumb. Exhale, warrior two. Looking at the right thumb. Inhale, reverse warrior. Looking at the right thumb. Warrior two. Gaze up at that 18 inch mark. Step back to a plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Knees are off the floor. And down. Left foot steps forward. Square your hips. Gaze at the left thumb, warrior one. Exhale, two. Woo. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, two. Inhale, hands down. Step, uh, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Five breaths there. Hold the tummy in. Relax your eyes. And soothe yourself with your breath. Calm yourself down. Everything's okay. Notice the nature of your mind. If you get agitated, if you get panicked, keep yourself calm. Bring your feet up to the top of the mat to touch. Look up, which means get your ass out from behind the mat and get it up, forward over the ankles, stomach in, forward bend. Bend the knees deeply, inhale, arms up. Straighten the legs. Exhale, hands down. Again, and then into triangle, bend the knees, inhale. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, look up, step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. The right foot steps forward. Remember before you stand, I like to keep my right foot to the side and my left foot to the side. I don't line up like this. I feel like it twerks the knees. So keep a, I keep a little runway where nothing touches except for my feet when they join. Okay, warrior one. Warrior two, and then you straighten the right leg and you reach for triangle. Now, if you're just kind of new, you just work on this, trying to stretch the inner thigh, get the arm down, try to lift up as high as you can, stretching through here, lifting up, watching the thumb, arm over the ear, and you twist up. And then exhale, warrior two. Inhale, hands down. Step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Left foot steps forward. Inhale, one. Exhale, two. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, reach. Eye is up on the right thumb. Breathe, relax, keep telling yourself, everything's okay. 
Everything's okay. Arm over the ear. Everything's okay. Everything's okay. Up to warrior two. Build your will, your determination, and your stamina. Hands down, step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Breathe there. Try to relax. I'm sitting on my knees. Don't copy me unless you're really tired. I won't run out of breath if I keep moving. Breathe, press your heels down, soften your eyes, shake out your head, suck your tummy in. Send a good vibe through the body. Look up at the 18 inch mark. Walk your feet to the top of the mat. Exhale, forward bend, head to the knee. Bend the knees deeply. Inhale up, straighten the legs. Exhale down. And again, and I'm gonna give you a quick tip about chaturanga. Chaturanga is not going down like that, right? Does that look like chaturanga? Probably. It's like, Ugh. Chaturanga isn't going down like that. Chaturanga is opening. So even if you just go part way, it's just like that. That is better than that. Don't squeeze your arms in. Okay, that lecture's over. Bend the knees, inhale, arms up. Exhale, forward bend, head to the knee. Inhale, look up, step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Right foot steps forward. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. Straighten the right leg. Rotate a triangle. Right hip pulls back, right hand drops, left arm reaches forward to the outside of the right foot. The right hand comes past the nose and then opens. You don't want to open here where the shoulders drop. Bring it up here and open. And if you're low, it's like this. And if your arm hurts, you go like this. Eventually you'll get here. Take some time. Warrior two, inhale, hands down, chin up, chest up, spread the heart up, up dog, push the heart up, down dog, left foot forward, inhale, warrior one, exhale, warrior two, straighten the left leg, rotate a triangle, breathe, breathe, Stay calm. If you need to bend your knee a little bit, hold on to a chair. I never use props, I just use my body. I've been stuck like this for many years before I was able to move. Just wait in and out. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, hands down. Step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Five breaths. Wait, did we do left side? Yes. Breathe. Sometimes I'll bring my knees down a little bit and bring my ribs to my thighs to stretch out the shoulders, shake out the head, straighten the legs, tummy in, exhale. Look up between the hands, bring the feet forward, look up, flat back, exhale, head to knee. Bend the knees deeply. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, straighten. All right, let's get through this last part. It's hard. Stay with it. Here we go. Bend the knees. Inhale. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, look up. Step back to a plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up. Exhale back, right foot steps forward, inhale, exhale two, hands in prayer, drop the right shoulder down in front of the right knee, press the hips forward, pull the head up and back, open the arms, look up towards the hand, 
Breathe. Arm over the ear. Breathe. Stay there. If you're binding, you can bind. You can straighten your leg. Up to warrior two, exhaling. Inhale, hands down, step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Left foot steps forward. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. Hands in prayer. You don't want to drop two down, far down like that. Stay up. Pivot this way like your triangle. Then drop. Press down. Push back into the leg. Open. And then if you're modifying, you're just kind of like this, you know, waiting, getting down here maybe, okay? Arm behind the back if you're binding. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, hands down, step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Five breaths. Keep calming yourself. You're all you got. You gotta keep telling yourself, I can do this. Don't give up. Comfort is overrated. You got this. One more left, then we relax and meditate, and your body's gonna be filled with great energy. Feet at the top of the mat. Exhale forward, bend. Bend the knees deeply. Inhale the arms up. Straighten the legs. Arms down. Remember, if you're not watching me for instruction, try to keep your gaze steady. Really watch the thumb, you know, watch the thumb, watch the thumb, watch the mark in front of your place. Okay, ready? Last one. Bend the knees. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, forward bend, head to the knee. Inhale, look up, step back to a plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Right foot steps forward, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. Now we're gonna do rotated prayer on the other side like we did on this side, but now we're gonna do it on that side like rotated triangle. The left heel comes off the floor. Take a prayer. Move here, and then you try to twist to get your prayer in the center of the body as best you can. You can also drop the back leg, get yourself gripped here, and then open. So you're here, and then opening. If this heart is hard, drop the back knee. Get there, and then slowly try to lift. And if you kind of touch the floor, just keep your hands here, row. Up to warrior two, exhale, inhale, hands down. Step back, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Left foot steps forward. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. And then we're gonna go to the other side. Right heel comes up, prayer to the outside. Twist, you can drop the leg and twist. And then open up. Breathe. If you're advanced in binding, you can bind there. Arm over the ear. Up to warrior two. Exhale. Inhale, hands down. Step back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale up. Exhale back. Five breaths. You did it. That was it. Give yourself a big smile. Feel your heels pressing down. Feel the body. Feel the belly hollow. hollow. Look up between the hands. Look up at that 18 inch mark. Get the hips forward. And forward bend, head into the knees. Bend the knees deeply. Inhale the arms up. Exhale the arms down. Woo! That is a workout. And it does everything. So lay on your mat now, and you're gonna rest for a couple minutes. And this is really the most important part. I mean, we do all this 
yoga stuff to prepare our bodies and our minds to sit in meditation. Um, particularly now, if you're not good at relaxing, now's your time to practice. So lie down on your mat, make yourself comfortable. You know, you should make a little space under the armpit so your arms aren't close like that. You know, make a little space. And then allow yourself to be. Some habits, you know, you might get into that you might want to lose is just being suspicious of your body. Oh, God, I should have started this long ago. Oh, my neck isn't right. Let all that behind. Five minutes here to be in pure consciousness. Like, drop it all. Relax your brain. Let your brain rest to the back of the skull and circulate fresh oxygenated blood and infuse that blood with a smile so that blood moves happily through the body. Smile in the brain, excreting happy and healthy hormones. Relax the scalp. Feel your heart beating and pumping blood through the body and your lungs going. And don't hold in grip. Let go of all resistance. Let that blood and oxygen rush through the body, cleaning everything. Relax the eyes and the muscles behind the eyes. Try to relax. A lot of people, I mean, it feels like it sucks for them to relax. It's hard to, harder learning to relax than a headstand. But this is the time where you really reset your body here. Let go of tension. Everything's okay. Soften the nose, feel the sinuses open. Feel the ears open and the warmth of the blood in the ears. Relax the facial muscles. Relax the mouth. And inside the mouth. Relax the tongue. Relax the jaw. Feel the throat open. The bridge between the mind and the body. Jalandara chakra. Soften the shoulders, not by doing anything. This is just letting go. You're not going to fix anything and make it better. Everything you have to let go, let go, let go. Let go of the muscles in the upper arms. Relax the elbows, relax the forearms. Feel the energy going down the forearms. We're going to rest for another minute, and then we're going to sit up and meditate. Relax the upper back. Just because you're relaxing, it doesn't mean you're doing anything. There may not be a profound shift or awareness. You're just offering it to your body. Relax. Relax the middle back. Everything's okay. Relax the lower back. Soften. Soften the muscles away from the bones. No more gripping or holding. Relax the chest. See if you can feel your heart open. Opening, 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 open the heart. Relax down the sides of the body. Relax the ribs and the little muscles between the ribs. Relax the tummy, deep inside the stomach, where we hold fear and anguish, sorrow. It gets tight in there and we say bad things to ourselves. Forgive yourself for anything mean you've said. And let the belly relax deep inside. Feel the abdominal walls release. And then pretend you're up in the ceiling looking down at yourself and see yourself on the floor. And say, I love you. Like I would lay there and I would say, I love you, Hannah. And it feels awkward at first, but self-love sounds corny, but it's a profound healing energy. So lay on the floor and look at yourself, say you love yourself and allow yourself to feel that, okay? Get off the ceiling, back in the body, relax the hips, and the buttocks, and the thighs. You're just sending good flowing vibes through the body. Relax the knees, relax the calves, ankles, and the feet. And I know that's a rushed relaxation, but I'm impressed, very, very, very impressed if you were able to lie still in the middle of a busy day. And give yourself time to de-stress and relax after a hard workout. Okay, let's stretch the arms up overhead. 
Give yourself a last stretch. Send a wave of gratitude to the body. And then we'll come up to sit and meditate. And it's a quick meditation. Five minutes, right? 20 minute workout, five minute nap, five minute meditation. Let's do it. Do you know how to meditate? If you don't, I'm gonna, I didn't set a timer, so I'm gonna have to watch my clock. But if you don't know how to meditate, I'll tell you Anapana meditation. It's a beginner's Buddhist meditation. And you just watch the breath move in and out of the nose. That's it. You wonder why you reach for a cigarette, a cookie, this, that. We don't have control of our minds. So now you start to control your mind. Conscious mind, subconscious mind, all in one place, just by focusing at the breath. So feel the breath moving in and out of your nose. See if it's a little cooler when it comes in, warmer when it goes out. And then don't manipulate the breathing. Let the body breathe itself. And you're just going to watch. You're just going to see, do I feel any nose hairs? Can I feel anything under my nostrils? What are the physical sensations? So you're building your observational mind. You're paying attention. What can you feel in the nostrils and under the nostrils? Keep going, pretend nothing exists. You'll get it, pretend nothing exists except for your nose. And you know what, if you're tense, relax your hips and your thighs. Don't worry about you know, getting yourself upright. Just relax the hips and thighs as your best you can. The earth has got you, you can let it support your body. Focus on the nose. Two more minutes, okay? Try to resist temptation to move in pigeons. And when the mind is active, just bring it back. You just each time bring it back, bring it back. Feel this triangle under the nose. The nostrils are the wide part. Right above the top of the lip is the skinny part of the triangle. See what you can feel in there. And see what you can feel in nostrils. Try not to fidget. Two more minutes. Or one more minute. One minute. Stay there. Focus in the nose. Your mind starts to wander. Don't take it further by thinking about it. Just bring it back to the nose. Oh. Sato-ma-sato-mi-ya-tam-so-ma-jo-thir-tam-i-ya-mri-to-ma-mri-tam-gam-yam-om-pon-ham-i-da-pon-ham-i-da-pon-ha-pon-ham-ata-sha-te-
Holy shit. I think that was great. Right. Oh my God. That was my first one. Really? Are you going to keep doing, you're going to do a bunch, right? Yeah, I'm going to start next week teaching classes Monday, Wednesday, and Friday mornings and evenings. And I'm going to teach a free beginner class Wednesdays afternoon. Very cool. Okay. Thank you. I hope it was good. Did anyone join? Totally. Yeah, we had up. I'm, people are commenting now because they're having some technical difficulties, but I'm a little unsure why. Right. My I'll let you go. I hope it was good. I hope it I was, did. Yeah. I hope I did you Wolfers proud. No, it was great. So probably what'll happen is I'll pull it down, edit the video, and then put it back up later this afternoon. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye.